I would remember a lot of things from this year, especially being a part of this team. Just meeting new friends every year is definitely special. One, two, three, together. You're obviously going to miss the wins, obviously going to miss putting on that Temple jersey every day, but I think what else you're going to miss is the time we spent with your teammates, like going out to eat, just messing around in the locker room. Bus rides, you know, it's a lot of joking on, going around there, and you know, just a lot of fun times, a lot of fun memories. And I am not Jasmine, I am Aladdin. <laughs> I miss most about being with the guys would definitely be, you know, just all the good times we had together, all the laughs we shared, you know, not just basketball. Who was you taking in the dunk contest, the way out on the way out? Who was you taking, man? You know, hey. Who was you take? Who'd you take? I'm going my man boy. I don't know what you're talking about. I got you uh, tomorrow. <laughs> I'll, show, I'll show you something. These guys are at an age where the rest of their life is being shaped while they're here, while they're going through their college experience. All the news. I'm just yeah. grab my news. I don't want no saw. You get to love your teammates, and I think that's something that after this is all said and done, I think we'll be able to know our teammates for the rest of our lives. A lot of times I spend with these guys is definitely not enough. These guys, they're going to be my friends for the rest of my life. One, two, three. Together. I really admired that about this group and respected that about this group. And I think going through highs and lows throughout the season, that really builds character and builds bonds with you and your teammates. I think that was kind of our personality, how someone could step up and everyone could be counted on. Definitely passing that first round of the NCAA tournament, which was huge. It was it was huge for the people and for the whole university. I think that was one of the biggest moments in my career, by far. Just the excitement and you know going into the locker room and seeing all the smiles on everybody's faces. That's something that that was really special uh, for me to watch and be a part of. I think Lavoie was the reason I cried, and I just looked at Lavoie and I just saw you know look on his face and I just was like, man, this is this is last games. I mean, we're gonna miss him. The program we're gonna miss him. We're gonna miss him in the locker room. A lot of things that he's brought to this program has meant a lot. And for to see for him and you know play his last game in the Temple jersey was just sad. It still hasn't clicked I guess yet. Everything everything easier with Lavoy out there. He's a great player, probably the best player I played with. I don't know how much better of a college basketball career he could have had, both on an individual basis being the leading rebounder in the history of the school, scoring up well over a thousand points. It's gonna be impossible to replace him. We appreciate everything he has done. We're, we're so thankful because he's a big part of why Temple basketball is, is now in the spot we are. He was our foundation. We haven't really said goodbye to him yet, but we will soon and uh, it's difficult. But that's what happens in college sports. They're moving on and becoming men in some other field of endeavor. I think I've made a lot of good friends over, over the past four years, and you know, and, and that's more important. You know, the guys are more like me. In my future, you know, I'm looking forward to playing professional basketball. And I want to share my experiences with the guys. You know, I know, I know for sure. You know, they'll, they'll take the things I say to heart, and you know, just because we have a close relationship, things like that. And, you know, Mm -hmm. We're not sure what the personality of our team is going to be next year. Everybody made positive strides this year, so I think it'll be good for the future. So hopefully, you know, the guys next year, you know, see that losing Lavoie is going to be a big loss for us. But, you know, a lot of guys, you know, want to go in this summer and work hard and be able to, you know, fill that void. You're thinking about next year and how we could have done things better who we're going to have and, and start to form our teams. We really don't know. This year, a lot of times we, we battle through adversity of injuries. And next year, who knows? Hopefully, it's a personality that leads to a lot of wins. The determination to succeed, I hope that continues. I think they, they want to be champions of the Atlantic 10. And they want to represent Temple University and Temple basketball uh, the way they believe it should be. Just hopefully guys are ready and prepared and just able to, you know, have a good year. I think these guys will look back on this season and have great, great memories of each other and the things that they accomplish. It's not an easy life being a college basketball player, but it sure is a great life and take advantage of it.
Inside Temple Basketball was brought to you by the Philadelphia Federal Credit Union, the official credit union of Temple University.